Hello Internet and welcome to Pete's Media Reviews and welcome to this review of the book The Naked Sun, another Isaac Asimov novel. It's actually second in the Elijah Bailey novels and it feels like a natural second in this series uh, where once again the Terran detective must solve a crime though he must travel to a distant world, the world of Solaria this time where they have some pretty strange taboos and phobias. Now the blurb, which is the first section I'll mark, mark this on. Once again, this does what it says on the tin and represents the classic blurb for me telling the reader the basics and little more, simply because it would seem a bit verbose to do otherwise. So this scores a seven from me. I don't like unnecessary, uh, in a, unnecessariness in a blurb. <laughs> Just enough to hook me in, that's all I need. Uh, so that one scores a seven. Right, moving on to storyline then. Well, when I first read it all those years ago, back in the 80s, um, you know, probably even the last time I read it, which was maybe a couple of years ago, it all seemed pretty strange. Uh, it's got a society where people seclude themselves from other people wearing masks, gloves and nose filters for fear of uh, bacteria contamination. Hmm. Doesn't seem so far-fetched now, does it? <laughs> because we're living in this nightmare right now. But anyway, uh, I'm not going to get into that. The story is extremely well put together, however, and so gets another seven from me. So storyline is a seven. All right, then. Let's move on to writing style. Again, classic Asimov. Succinct enough with an excellent command of the English language and utilising enough literary tools to build the story construct in your head. Gets a seven from me again. So it's another seven. Personal enjoyment then. I really enjoyed this novel. It adds further layers to the main protagonist and his life on Earth. Whilst, of course, the story is about humanity and the human condition, because it's, it's a sci-fi novel, uh, it is an enjoyable sci-fi detective tale on any level. So that scores an 8 from me for, for um, personal enjoyment. Which brings me to re-readability then. Very re-readable. Gets a 9. So, I mean, I've read this countless times and I will continue to do so for some time to come. Read it and I've read it and I've read it. Um, I, I love the Elijah Bailey series of novels. By far the easiest Asimov books to read. And for me the most enjoyable. But anyway, that brings the overall score then to a very respectable 38 out of 50. Okay, so... The Naked Sun by Isaac Asimov scores 38 out of 50. So, yeah, it's um, it's another short novel, or, but it's uh, longer than a short story. Uh, it might be just a tad longer than The Caves of Steel, but um, don't hold me to that. It, um, let's have a look. Let's give you some idea of when this was first published. It was... First published by Panther Books in 1960. It's been reprinted many times over the years. Um, although it says here, first published in Great Britain in 1956. So, yeah. Very strange. Yeah, so you know a bit about Isaac Asimov anyway, because... Uh, I, I, I always find it fascinating, his command of the English language when he was, in fact, Russian. So, just so clever. Um, yeah, anyway, I'm not going to go on too much. It's a short book review, and that is it. The Naked Sun, 38 out of 50. Hope you enjoyed it. I do highly recommend you going out and reading it. If you're thinking about um, an Asimov book, the, the Elijah Bailey series is definitely a good place to start. I highly recommend them. So yeah, highly recommended. It's highly re-readable. You will enjoy it. I guarantee that. Thanks ever so much for watching. Um, until the next time, you live happily ever after. The end.